Kanye West is seen everywhere while shaking up pop culture with his antics. However, he has gone missing in recent weeks. Let's find out what's going on in the rapper's present life. According to reports, the rapper and producer's former business manager Thomas St. John has been unable to get in touch with the rap star as he is trying to sue him for a breach of contract. St. John has told the courtroom during a hearing that he hasn't had the chance to serve Kanye with the legal documents regarding the lawsuit. He claims that his and Kanye West's professional relationship started in March 2022 when West agreed to keep him on a monthly retainer of $300,000 as payment to be his business manager and the chief marketing officer of all things related to the Donda brand. St. John also explained that he and Kanye maintain a good business relationship until an aggressive meeting and the heated discussions led to their falling out and West not replying his messages. The lawsuit states, St. John needed a guarantee that West wouldn't abruptly abandon the commercial relationship in addition to the financial costs and hazards associated with committing to West as a client. But Mr. St. John offered to settle for a contract lasting at least 18 months. Thomas St. John is now aiming for $4.5 million in damages, which includes payments for the months of July, August, and September, as well as retainers for the remaining term of the defaulted agreement, which was set to end in November 2023. Well, Thomas is not the only person having issues with Kanye, as Kim Kardashian has also opened up about the battles of co-parenting their four kids with a popular rapper. Kim K told Angie Martinez that it's hard. Co-parenting is really hard. She had the best father, and she had the best memories and the greatest experience, and that's all she wants for her kids as long as they can have that. That's what she would want for them. Kim even admitted that she's done her best to shield her children from what the outside world is saying about Kanye's recent antics and the anger over his anti-Semitic comments, which have resulted in the loss of just about all of his business partnerships. The beauty mogul said, If they don't know the things that are being said or what's happening in the world, why would I ever bring that energy to them? That's really heavy grown-up shiz that they are not ready to deal with and when they are, we'll have those conversations. Before we move ahead, if you're liking this content so far, please consider subscribing and liking this video. Now, let's continue. Kanye West's toxic anti-Semitism is cashing in by some online retailers as the rapper-inspired neo-Nazi designs merch are emerging on the internet. According to reports, some online retailers are selling t-shirts dubbed with Kanye's 2024 presidential logo and Nazi swastika symbols. Some t-shirts have also boasted his tweet about a swastika inside a star of David in December, which led to his Twitter suspension. Anti-hate groups such as the Anti-Defamation League and the Combat Anti-Semitism movement have criticized the anti-Semitic merchandise sale, disturbed to see sites selling swastika-themed merch in support of West's presidential run. Some of the symbols seem to have originated among white supremacist trolls on 4chan in November and have since been combined into merch by online sellers including print-on-demand platforms. It is also evident that Kanye West's involvement in the merchandise or sale has not been proven, but his behavior and comments have already cost him a lot. He has gone in hot waters after YouTuber and Twitch streamer Adin Ross kicked him out for his anti-Semitic comments. West has been in the news for his irregular behavior, from stalking and torturing his ex-wife and her ex-boyfriend Pete Davidson to praising Hitler people have found his behavior extremely disturbing and triggering. He has been deplatformed from all the major social media platforms for promoting hate speech. Many famous brands have dropped their partnership with the star, which has also dropped his net worth. The debate of whether he really is a misunderstood genius came to an end after he went on Alex Jones' show. He endorsed Hitler and showed his love for the Nazis just a couple weeks after his anti-Semitic rant on Instagram. His suspicious comments spark rage among the public. His fall can be seen after his mother's death. West has said that he believes his mother was sacrificed by a force which controls the majority of the world. He is also very open about his mental illnesses. He is very vocal about his bipolar disorder as well as not taking his medications. However, his mental illness cannot excuse his behavior. His actions have motivated some of his fans to spread toxicity in real life, which is also not acceptable. His actions are causing intense effects and a lot of people think that he should not be forgiven in the name of free speech. He is also desperate to voice his disturbing opinions. 
His comments regarding Jewish people and the black community not only ignored the battles faced by them for ages, but also offend the last loss. His views on abortion and his running for 2024 president has also created a lot of debate. Kanye West definitely needs serious help and being surrounded by a bunch of fake people is not the genuine solution. He should come out of his shell to get proper support. What do you think about Kanye West's present situations? Tell us in the comment section below. With that being said, it's time to end our today's video. Press the like button and subscribe to our channel for more interesting stuff. Peace out.